you know, why I have a process of getting mom to drop the milk when they're hungry. Go ahead. They'll come in and they'll get the grain here on the milk can and then they'll go out and pasture for the day. And I'm a firm believer in using my pasture these days, how that cheese tastes because they can affect how the milk tastes. So I want to be careful of what they eat, but I want them to eat as natural as possible. Goats are ruminants. Is an animal that has several chambers and stomach, and they send their food to the first stomach and bring it back up and chew their cut, and that's where that term comes from chewing the cut. To get the most benefits out of it, then they digest it. Um, it's a hooved animal. from the central computer. The unit has Smart ID, equipped with high flow rates. It ensures fast, complete and safe milking out. It also enables better circulation of the cleaning solution and a more first time instantian barns, milk and feeding data can be automatically transferred to and from the Delaval Delpro Dairy Management System. So let's get you cleaned up. Okay, dear. Okay, Miss Ruby Love. Let's get you going. Just another day on the farm. Milking my lovely old Ruby. I've had Miss Ruby uh, for several years, and I've sold most all of my goats except her daughters because Ruby is such a prolific milker and has girl babies every year. She doesn't have boys, she has girls. And uh, look at the size of her teeth. Look at the size of her teeth. She's got such big, wonderful teeth. So, anyway, I set my jug down and just uh, give Miss Ruby a squeeze. Maybe you can see the milk building up in my jar. I don't know. Most of that is foam because uh, foam is what comes on the milk. As you can see, my jar is filling up, and I'm going to let the foam run out because I don't like the foam. And the foam has anything that falls in there, like dust, dirt, hair, anything is in the foam. So I always let the foam just run over. And the cat comes along and comes in here and licks that foam up. Oh, Ruby. A little.
Okay, let's see. That might not be getting you though. That ought to do it. Here we go. Let's see if we can get you going. Oh, girl. What are you doing with all that milk in your tank? Hmm, it's darn it, you're wearing me. Oh, I'm sorry, dear. I hit your nerve. I didn't mean to. I'm sorry, honey, put your leg down. I know. You got that nerve right there, and Mama hits it, doesn't she? Yeah, yeah I think it gives you a tickle, doesn't it? Doesn't hurt some. Quit kicking, silly girl. Okay. Oops, I'll be still, Miss Garnett. Okay, sweetie pie. You white goats, and that's what she is. So, we'll continue this milking on another video. Goodbye. building up in my jar. I don't know. Most of that is foam because uh, foam is what comes on the milk. As you can see my jar is filling up and I'm going to let the foam run out because I don't like the foam. And the foam has anything that falls in there like dust, dirt, hair, anything is in the foam. So. I was like the phone just run over and the cat comes along and comes in here and licks that phone up. Oh Ruby. A little
from the central computer. The unit has Smart ID, equipped with high flow rates. It ensures fast, complete and safe milking out. It also enables better circulation of the cleaning solution and a more first time instantion barns, milk and feeding data can be automatically transferred to and from the Delaval Delpro Dairy Management System. So let's get you cleaned up. Okay, dear. Okay, Miss Ruby Love. Let's get you going. Just another day on the farm. Milking my lovely old Ruby. I've had Miss Ruby uh, for several years, and I've sold most all of my goats except her daughters because Ruby is such a prolific milker and has girl babies every year. She doesn't have boys, she has girls. And uh, look at the size of her teeth. Look at the size of her teeth. She's got such big, woo 